Okay, here we are in uh, a Florida Heritage National Historical Site. The dedicated to all those who drew draw living waters from the well spring of God's abundance, March 1995. And apparently you can get nice fresh water out of there. Look at that. It's true. And right across the street from that is the famous Braden Castle here in Bradenton, Florida. And there's what's left of it. Apparently it used to be much more majestic two-story building and that's those are the ruins of this castle it looks like it's made out of seashells and uh, seashells and mud maybe hard to say but here's the plaque for it Braden Castle and there's what it looked like um, let's see when did he build this somewhere around 18 45 the building began and building completed in 1851 so just before the Civil War this building was constructed and there's all the other important dates burned by woods fire sold to camping tourists of America in 1924 and that's who owns the park today well, Braden Castle ruins Dr. Joseph Addison Braden, Braden, presumably the same Braden that the town of Bradenton is named after. The ruins were purchased by the Camping Tourists of America in 1924. So we can't actually go in there, but there is a big beautiful banyan tree in there that's nice and peaceful because nobody can go in and bother it. So where we can go is down the end of the street here to this 750 foot long pier. Little village town, um, technically a mobile home park, but a lot of these homes were built um, prior to when the mobile homes came in. And here we are, waterfront, at the end of the street, at the Braden Castle Pier. And as you can see, it really is a good 750 feet long. Okay, that's it for World Travel Guide.